combine, writing your answer using radical notation. Make sure the denominator is rationalized. So we have a seventh root of x to the fifth y to the eighth on the top in the numerator. And that's divided by the third root of x squared y to the fourth. And uh, in order to combine, they both have, have to have the same radicand. So the LCD of 7 and 3 would be 21. It's the number that they both go into. So what we're going to do is we're going to multiply the exponents in the radicand and the top all by 3 and the exponents in the radicand and the bottom all by 7. So we get the 21st root of x to the 15th y to the 24th. See, everything's been multiplied by 3. And as long as you are multiplying the radicand and the exponents all by the same number, you're allowed to do that. And the bottom will be the 21st root of x to the 14th y to the 28th. And if we, um, you know, since now they both have the same radicand, we can make it all one big um, radical you know, radical of x to the 15th, y to the 24th on top, and x to the 14th, y to the 28th on the bottom. Well, that's going to be equal to, um, now 15 minus 14 is just x, 24 minus 28 is negative 4, so we're going to keep that y to the 4th on the bottom you don't want to have negative exponents. So we get the 21st root of x over y to the fourth. Well, that would be good, except that we have a um, radical on the bottom. So we want to split it up. We have the 21st root of x over the 21st root of y to the fourth. Well, what we need to do is raise y so it has a power that's a multiple of 21. Um, and since it's only 4, the, the quickest way to get there is to get to 21. So if we think, you know, 21 minus 4, that's equal to 17, I need to raise it to the 17th power in order to make this happen. So we're looking at the 21st root of x over the 21st root of y to the 4th. And I'm going to multiply the top and the bottom by the 21st root of y to the 17th. And as long as I'm doing it to the top and the bottom, it's perfectly legit. So in the top, and they're both uh, the radical is, is the same, so I can combine them and make it the 21st root of x, y to the 17th. And in the bottom, same thing. It's going to be the 21st root of y to the 21st. However, the 21st root and the power of 21 cancel out, and I get just y on the bottom, and the 21st root of x, y to the 17th on the top. So I've rationalized my denominator, and I've combined everything.